Well, on my last game, when I was about to go and get some LMG kills, it crashed between the loading maps. And I think the server may have been switched to an obliteration server. Which I don't want to play. So, uh, we're going to play the Wild West server with pistols only. After I check that. Basically, uh, if you get a kill with any weapon besides a handgun or a knife, it will ask you to stop, and if you do it a second time, it will kick you. So, you are pretty much literally forced to only use handguns, otherwise you get kicked. Yeah. That's how it goes. Um, it's fun. It's a fun game type. I'll get that last ammo ribbon here, by the way. Since everyone needs ammo for the handguns, they're out of ammo so fast. Um, also, the in-game stats on the handguns and stuff... Uh, are completely wrong. They actually are... most of them are fake. As in, like, they'll say that the CZ does more damage than the 9mm handgun, but if you look at the actual game stats, it does the exact same damage. So, uh, look up the stats online if you're trying to compare weapons. Don't look at them on the actual game uh, stat sliders, because they're fake. And I, I do quite literally fake, like, they're just complete and utter lies. It's good for a rough, rough estimate, but... It's not good for determining. Oh yeah, um... Serial Grapist. Yeah. He's gonna grape him in the mouth. Uh... The rule about, uh, no kills without pistols on the server also is relevant to grenades. So if you try to blow up people with grenades, you also get kicked. However, uh, flashbangs don't kill people most of the time, so you can use those if you want, if you want to risk it. They do 5 damage, so it's not really a huge risk. Just defibbed. <laughs> what? I got defib by a teammate, and then... okay. Yeah. I got defib killed, though. That's always fun. I thought that was out of the game. It was really glitchy in the last game. I got a, a desert camo, hoping that the slide would be tan, but the, t the slide really isn't tan. It's just kind of like, you know, same color. Before. So... Uh, to get these guys, I need to go around them. So... Yeah, this is the only way I can kill these guys here. They see me, though. Yeah, some guy saw my feet sticking out. Uh, the silencer is gonna go back on, that way I can be stealthy. Because... the... You don't... people don't really think about it, but the actual sound bo bonuses... They help. People will not see you. Uh, you have to manually switch to your handgun when you first join. If you decide to play on the server, you don't, uh forget that. I've seen people, like, they spawn in next to an enemy, they start panic shooting, and they just get kicked because they kill someone accidentally. Uh, I should mention that when you uh, kill someone with a non-pistol, it uh, automatically kills you. <laughs> it slays you, so... Keep that in mind. If you uh, die randomly, it's probably because you accidentally killed someone grenade or something. I'm not doing too well. We're getting kind of spawn trapped. Uh, luckily the spawn's switched. So I'm gonna go over here and capture this. There we go. Getting a little bit better. That, uh, that last bullet in your, uh... What did I get? I just got something. I heard a unlock noise. 
Look like I unlocked something. But I didn't get anything. Hmm. See what the spam factor comes in though? There's just certain handguns that are designed to spam at close range. Like the 93R, it, it's a spam weapon. It's also where the, the lying about stats comes in. The 93R and the uh, G18 have about half the damage that the bar says they have. The slider bars say that they have the same damage as the 9mm handguns, when in reality, for balancing purposes, they have about 40% less damage per bullet. Which, you know, they I mean they lie about it. If they didn't lie, it wouldn't be a problem, but they blatantly lie. There's nothing really to say about lying, except that it's bad. If they updated the stat slider bars to make them relevant, it would be nice. You know? They'll use the game's information to help determine stuff like it's supposed to be. Instead of make people like anticipate weapons and be like, oh, this is going to be really good, I really want this weapon. Should note, except for the handguns, though, uh, damage is basically determined by bullet type. There's no like random damage differences between guns, except for handguns. The handguns have automatic the counterparts. That's the only reason why they're different. I mean, as you can tell, you run out of ammo really fast, so support is probably the best class to go with. But if you need recon stuff, go recon. Get your uh, beacons out there. That way, your teammates can use them. Do whatever you need to do. Help your team. Uh, oh, yeah, that was a flashbang. I, th I thought I forgot to switch them, so I thought I accidentally threw a frag into the window. So good. Anyway, flashbangs are pretty bad, to be honest. They're kind of not really gag weapons, they're just so useless. I don't find them very fun. Oh, we're getting a B, that's not good. Get it back. Is my entire team running away from the control points? <laughs> These ten guys are just running into the corner of the map for no apparent reason. Whatever, I'm gonna go get A. Uh, I believe I can get A by myself. Yeah, it's already taken. <laughs> People tend to not camp the control points. Well, okay, A, A gets camp, but it's really easy to kill the campers. Uh, this control point gets super camped, and it's really hard to kill them at, so this is the one where you really want to focus your attention, is B. If you lock down B, you have, you can have the game set, basically. See, I'm getting shot through, I got shot through a giant pole, did you see that? <laughs> like, just blatantly shot through a big metal concrete pole. Remember away from him to hit me. I guess I should probably defend A because the entire enemy team is spawning there. That might help a bit. Uh, let's frag out first. There we go. Still got shot even though I threw a flashbang. Let's get another one out there. Yeah, flashbangs are worthless. <laughs> they don't do anything. Uh, I'll demonstrate the range that the flashbang effect has, actually, on myself. So, let's test this. 
So about five feet. Nothing. Right at your feet. Then it blinds you. For two seconds. So <laughs> if you're uh, a couple feet away from the grenade, it will do basically nothing except five damage to you. And annoying. Yes. Kind of worthless. In my opinion. mistake they made was to camp away from the control point, which basically meant they couldn't contest the point while they were camping it. They had to be... Dang it. Not a single hit. <laughs> Not one single hit. That hurts. Yeah, I'm calling BS on that. He just managed to kill me with three bullets from a 5.7 at long range. I can't breathe without getting shot from halfway across the map. You might be saying, oh, this looks pretty good at medium range. Why don't you. Why did you say it was bad earlier? It's not that it's bad, it's that the damage per second is really low. Against people with pistols, it's fine, it's sufficient, right? But. If you're fighting people without handguns, it turns into a pretty slow. killing weapon at long range. Close range, though, seems okay. Aim down the sights, it's good. out of the woodwork. Not even sure. There are just three guys on the balcony. Oh, what? Okay. I don't want to shoot these guys. That would be spawn killing. But they're shooting my teammates, so I gotta attack them. Once this round ends, I'm going to try to find a domination server again that, uh, can, that I can use my support with because I want to level up support, obviously. So leading your shots is very important with these handguns because, as I said before, this thing shoots rocks. They're really slow. Very slow bullets. Somehow, some way. Yeah, I mean, you can see they're just camping it up.
go in here without getting... Actually, yeah, we got this point locked down. Push up here. Avoid getting... Oh, why is he not dead? These things leave a nice smoke cloud. They're gonna grab B. Are grabbing B. Dang it. Every single time. Just get shot from halfway across the map. Uh, heavy barrels gotta go back on. This long range inabilities not helping me. So we went from rock bullets to real bullets, as you can see. He's actually. With a decent velocity. Yeah, that ammo thing. Should end soon. Oh no, it's not even close. I'm gonna quit.